And I was only about four. And uh, I took one look at him and I was scared out of my wits because he was so terrifying to look at from a small child's point of view. And his big glasses, all goggly glasses, and it was just, gosh. <laughs> when I was born, and he actually delivered me at 12 St Leonard's Place. He had sort of become a friend of the family in a way, because uh, National Health Service started in 1948. So it's before that. So doctors made a charge for calling. I can't remember if it was seven and six or 12 and six. But he always said that he used to waive the charge because as other people could pay. He looked terrifying, but he was very kind. <laughs> when I was four, I got measles and he came up to see me and he bought me a pedal car, which in 1946 would have cost a, a lot of money and was very rare. And he bought me that as a present to get well. And he didn't charge my parents for the call either. When I was 14, I had a very serious accident on a boat in the North Sea. He came to see me and he took me out for a ride to cheer me up. He thought of people like that, you know. And that was in the middle of the trial, I think, or it was around about the time of the trial. I mean, he had so much on his mind. The fact that he could do that, I found was quite overwhelming. My uncle was one of the first detectives on the case when it came up. And he, um, after the long time that he spent on it, he was absolutely convinced that Dr Adams was innocent. That didn't last because there was another detective who was determined that he was guilty. And so he got my uncle removed from the case. I can remember when I was 15, people said, when well, this trial came on, that he did look guilty. People wouldn't be surprised if he had been guilty. People were very condemning, you know, they, they, they read the paper, you know, 400 deaths, one headline said, you know. It's just unfortunate he gained, virtually every death he gained, which was a bit suspicious. And I always, I never thought that he would have done it for gain alone. He'd have been very kind and he'd have wanted to see people easily into the next world.